All right, in the last video, guys, you see me press up a track suit. I totally forgot that I was supposed to add an extra large t-shirt. I remembered at the last minute, so we went ahead and got that done. So now I'm bringing you guys a separate video. In this video, you're gonna learn how to do a two color design using only one color, allowing the shirt color to show through through negative space. Hope you guys enjoy this video right after my intro. <laughs> So instead of using the two color design to get the white shirt, I'm going to make this whole thing a one color design. And we're just going to use this last piece of red flock that I had to complete it. And this time, instead of putting white on top or something, we're just going to let the shirt color show through. Uh, and that's it. So as again, if you stay tuned to the end, I'll tell you how much I'm going to charge for this one color shirt. Design is done. All right, uh, we're gonna go ahead and just gonna drag out the old two color uh, file and I'm going to go ahead and pull in the multicolor, I'm sorry, the one color design. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip this horizontally and I just wanna make sure, I know I shrunk it a little bit. I wanna make sure that it's sized the same and appropriately um, as the big one was, I'm sorry, the two color was. So, I'm just gonna resize it a little bit. Boom, and boom, that should put me right. A little bit smaller than I wanna be, right there. All right, perfect. So now I got my one color, and you guys are gonna get to see how this comes out this time. So, boom, actually I'm gonna maximize it just a hair. Why not? It's not going on, is it? Um, all right. So I'm going to load this up. I just want to make sure it's the right length. So one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, about eight and a half inches. It should be good. Yeah, it's right at it's right at the nine mark. So I'm actually going to go ahead and cut this on the mat. Cause I, just in case it doesn't hold or it's not enough, we can make sure the mat is holding it. I'm gonna trim it, mat, trim this red flock a little bit. When you cut without the mat, you only get like um, you got you have to have an inch, a full inch of space at the bottom, um, or it won't hold because it has to feed in towards where the blade is by the inch between the two. Uh, so whenever you get close to that, like I said, anytime you got to find detail, you want to go ahead and use a cutting mat or anytime you're like using scraps that may not be long enough rather than waste this. And this is the only sheet that I have. So rather than waste it, I just want to go ahead and use the cutting mat to make sure that it holds on and doesn't uh, throw itself off. So that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. Right now, load it up. Uh, and again... I'm going to use my regular Thermoflex set, cut settings, uh, which we know uh, is good enough. And I'm going to go ahead and select the, oh, I don't have it plugged up. Plug up my cutter. I can't wait to get to that Cameo 4 and Bluetooth. I should have bought that one to the shop, uh, but I had a rush and I didn't. So go ahead, boom. All right, and send it to the cutter. You guys can watch it cut. All right, so you guys know I just normally speed through the cutting, but I was actually weeding and a customer came in and started talking to me. So I just went ahead and speeded through this as well. But right back to the video. Okay, so I already weeded uh, out the one for the shirt. Like I said, I'm gonna do a two color design using an actual one color print by using negative space to show the letters uh, on the jacket. Uh, there was a white background with red top. On here, I'm gonna do just a red outline and then the letters will show through with the shirt color, which will be white. So I'm gonna go ahead and load it up. 
All right, and again, I use my fingers on both sides just to make sure the shirt is even and consistent. And then we're just gonna line the shirt up. I use four fingers, which is about three and a half inches from the collar. And we're just gonna line it up here. And then I wanna make sure that it's touching in the same spot on both sides of my hand, which it is. And then now that that's ready, just gonna go ahead and press it up. I had the pillow on the last one, so I'm gonna loosen it up a little bit. And then we should be good to go. Five, four, three, two, one, boom. All right, so now we just let this cool down and now it has a matching shirt with the track suit. As soon as this cools down, we'll peel it. All right, guys, I just finished up the shirt. As you guys seen, it's a real quick job. I took a two color design and actually pressed it in one color and it still shows up in two color with the shirt color coming through. Uh, this shirt right here, if you think about it, it will be like a $15 shirt. The upgrade, the flock, I had an extra five dollars. So just the $20 shirt all together, the design was done. So it wasn't no design if you needed to be added. And that was pretty much it. So if you like videos like this, make sure you subscribe. Again, down in the comments below, let me know. Uh, has a customer ever added something last minute? Or did you ever forget something that you forgot to add to an order last minute? Uh, this has been your boy, Stan Bates from T-Shirt Side Hustle. Peace. Boy, Stan Bates from T-Shirt Side Hustle, and I got a package in the mail. I had it for a little while, but I wanted to make sure I opened it on video. And this is from my man, Gully. I know it's in here because I paid for it and purchased it. Just like you should pay for it and purchase it. This is a Be Your Vision t-shirt that I'm going to rock and wear proudly for my guy Gully over there. Supporter, fan, this is good work right here. And I'm always working on being my vision. That's what this whole thing is about. T-shirt size so is my vision. Almost three years now, January 4th, it'll be three years since I decided to start T-shirt side hustle. And it's perfect example of being your vision, seeing it through. I didn't make money for two years on this thing. And now I'm sitting, raking in some cash. So be your vision, shout out to Gully Visionaries. Make sure you guys go check them out on Instagram and support them. It's been your boy Stan Banks, peace.